नमस्कार आमार नाम होच्छे रोशना राय आमी अच्छे वेस्ट बेंगल थे के आमार होच्छे बातचीतर जन्नो अशुभिदर जन्नो एक हैं डे ऐसे ची तार कारण होच्छे बातचीता आमार होच्छे जालमो थे के होच्छे ओर अशुभिदा मने पाखना होए ना तो अखुन ओर जन्नो होच्छे आमला अनेक डॉक्टर देखाई ची ये देखाई ची तो अखुन शेही � सजेशन पाए नहीं, तो तार पर होच्छे अनेक जगह भोती रखा हुई चे, तो तात्थे क्यों किचु ठीक है नहीं, तो होच्छे पेशेंट के नाम होच्छे मायंग रहा है, तो अखुन होच्छे अम्रा एक होच्छे काकुर गास थे के बोलते पहले कोडिंगल हग, तो उनार होच्छे थ्रू थे के अम्रा होच्छे डॉक्टरी मने पॉलिमर्शन ये थे के देखा न हुए थे तो वही सार बोल चें जे एरो को मेरे को बिशाय नहीं है तो बोल चें जे पूरा आशुभिदास से तो आम्रा होचे वही सारे रिये थे के तो बोल चें जे ऑपरेशन करते लग बे तो आम्रा इखने ऐसे ची आशर पर तो इखने टाइ होचे आमदरी के शॉप टीकमेंट भालो करे ये करा होचे चेकअप करा होचे चेकअप शेकअप कोई दे � तो तो के पायखना है ना तो एक उन सर बोल चाहे ऑपरेशन पूरा हो चाहे साइड दे कर चाहे तो नेक्स्ट टाइम आवार रास्ते बोले चाहे आवार आशा र बोले मने जॉइनिंग कोई दिवे नीचे पायखना रास्ता दिए जॉइनिंग कोई रे शुष्ट हो बे शेटा हमारे के जाने चाहे वो इस सारे थ्रू ते के आम्रा ऐसे चाहे आज के हमारे working in this hospital, Shadamalakpet, since 21 years. Recently, I have seen a four-year-old boy, uh, Mr. Uh, Master Mayank Roy. This boy I have seen in uh, our Siliguri uh, Information Center, where the boy presented with uh, uh, severe abdominal distension, that is abdominal bloating and uh, you know the child was not uh, able to take any food and he was uh, hardly with all you know repeated medication he used to pass uh, tools uh, once in a week and with the same history the child has been roaming around many pediatricians gastroenterologists and many surgeons in the city of siliguri and they've gone to even bangalore and some other referral centers also but the child was being treated as chronic constipation. But when I saw, I examined the boy, he was in colonic obstruction and he was having abdominal uh, distension and child was, uh, uh, you know, uh, in a distress and he was uh, uh, not at all comfortable and he was moderately active. And I clinically diagnosed it as could be a, a sigmoid volvulus or could be you know uh, mega colon that is his springs disease but his general condition was not that bad and you know they will have failure to thrive uh, and they will have the ch child will have problems since uh, in uh, the childhood in the from the from birth to our surprise i asked them to advise them to come to our center in hyderabad uh, to uh, evaluate the child further and you know uh, we'll treat accordingly the facilitator and the mother of the child they got convinced and they came all the way to uh, hyderabad to our center in malakpet eshoda malakpet here we have examined the child and we we have uh, conducted series of investigations we have done a ct scan abdomen and a colonoscopy where we did the colonic biopsy and the, the sigmoid colon, colonic biopsy, the sigmoid colon was congested and it was the mucosa was uh, uh, edematous and there were uh, uh, no ulcers or no uh, mass lesions in the colon. And uh, the biopsy was done to rule out the egg ganglionosis and the report come as we expected as normal, uh, uh, normal uh, inflammatory colonic mucosa. 
and then we planned for laparotomy and uh, myself and uh, our uh, pediatric surgeon dr vikram danturi we we operated the child and we, we resected we have done a, a hartman's procedure we resected the colon was uh, uh, you know massively dilated it was uh, because of uh, volvulus there was pregangrenous changes uh, the, and uh, there was redundant colon and the sigmoid colectomy we have done and then we have done a end colostomy and this child we are planning uh, for a, a pull through maybe after uh, three or four months of the primary surgery and the child recently I have seen I have reviewed the child in our uh, information center in Pradhan Nagar, Siliguri where the child is very comfortable and nicely eating now and he is uh, uh, definitely uh, uh, gained uh, around uh, half kg of weight and is very comfortable the day when i have seen him first he was so uh, distressed he was in distress and he was child was moderately active he was he was not he, uh, looking healthy he was very ill and then subsequently after the uh, primary surgery is doing well and we are planning for the definitive operation that is uh, pull through rectal pull through operation and with which i think he will he will do a, lead a normal life uh, a clinical pure clinical diagnosis and confirmation by diag uh, the diagnostic tests which are necessary and subsequent treatment which is very very important so a good clinical acumen will help many a times many pediatricians also they have seen this child but unfortunately the diagnosis was missed and the child is being suffered uh, almost for a uh, for two years as a team in our Yashoda uh, every department we work uh, in harmony and we try to help the patients out thank you hi this is dr vikram danturi consultant pediatric surgeon Yashoda hospital malakpet a three-year-old child, Mayank, uh, presented with the chief complaints of uh, abdominal distension and not, not passing stools since birth. And he has consulted a lot of uh, doctors in West Bengal, uh, but all of them has managed him with conservative management with laxatives and uh, suppositories, proctoclasis, enemas. But the problem which the child is facing has not been settled. Uh, they have visited Ashoda Hospital camp in West Bengal. Uh, from there, he has visited Ashoda Hospital Malakpet. Here, the child has been examined and evaluated for constipation. And uh, on contrast enema, it has been shown to be uh, classical segment Hirschsprung's disease. Uh, the child has been prepared for elective surgery. Uh, we have done a Hartman's procedure in which uh, sigmoid end colostomy has been done by which uh, all the aganglionic segment has been deviated. Uh, Post-surgery on PO2, uh, post-operative 2, uh, the child has been started feeds, uh, the colostomy is functioning well, and uh, the biopsy showed it to be like aganglionic segment in the distal colon. Uh, the definitive procedure is planned uh, three months later. Uh, now the child is uh, reviewed with whatever problem he has. Thank you.